Hello everybody and welcome to the Open Courseware. This course is entitled Experimentation in Physical Chemistry. The different professors that have performed this course are two associate professors, Jorge Bañuelos and Leire Pérez, three assistant professors, Leire García, Leire Ruiz and Antonio Veloso, and a lecturer, Rebecca Solayano. The main objective of this course is to understand better the physical chemistry fundamentals by laboratory method and using experimental techniques. The student acquires abilities to design experiments, manage chemical techniques and measure physicochemical properties and data treatments. The organization of this course is summarized in this table. We have three different types of work, a theory, a laboratory sessions and evaluations. In the theory, we are going to work on theoretical basics. We have seven uh, different lessons. In laboratory sessions, we have eight experiments. And finally, we have evaluation that is going to be a test. This experimental subject is based on chemistry fundamentals. So we are going to work on thermodynamics, kinetics, electrochemistry and macromolecules by measuring the microscopic properties. The first lesson is about chemical thermodynamic and thermochemistry. And we have the first experiment that is entitled Half of Combustion Determination Using a Bone Calorimeter. The main objective of this experiment is to determine the formation enthalpies of maleic and fumaric acids by combustion enthalpies determination. The second lesson is about partial molar properties. And the experiment here is entitled Determination of Partial Molar Volume of Alcohol Water Solution. The main objective of this experiment is the determination of the mixture volume and partial molar volumes of the components of a binary solution with different composition. The third lesson is about phase equilibrium and here we have two different experiments. The first one is entitled phase diagram of liquid vapor system with the main objective of uh, to build the liquid vapor phase diagram of a binary mixture and the second one that is about phase diagram of solid liquid system and the aim of this study is the solid liquid equilibrium in a system featuring the two totally mistable liquids. The fourth lesson is about chemical equilibrium and here the experiment is entitled determination of equilibrium constant at different temperatures. The main objective of this experiment is to calculate the solubility constant of an odd mass soluble salt, in this case potassium periodic, and we are going to study the effect of temperature. The fifth lesson is about electrochemistry and here the experiment, uh, the experiment is entitled determination of thermodynamic magnitude. The main objective of this experiment is to determine, determine the entropy, Gibbs energy and enthalpy variation, uh, variation of an oxidation reduction reaction. The seventh lesson is about chemical kinetics. So here the experiment that we are going to perform is kinetic or basic hydrolysis of ethyl acetate. We have here two different objectives to study the conductivity of strong and weak electrolytes and to track the kinetics of a chemical reaction by conduct conductometry. The seventh lesson and the last one is about macromolecules and here the experiment is entitled polymer synthesis and characterization and we are going to also to characterize the molecular wave of our polymer. So we have two different objectives. The first one is to analyze the different types of polymerization reactions and the second one is to determine the average molecular weight of a polymer anal uh, analyzing also the end groups of these polymers. Here we have the different bibliography that we are going to use. We have a fundamental one, for instance, the experimental physical chemistry, a laboratory textbook from Freeman, the experiments in physical chemistry from, from McGow Hill, the physical chemistry methods, techniques and experiments from Sanders College and Curso Experimental en Química Física from Synthesis Editorial. If you want more information about these different experiments, you can take them from a journal of chemical education. Finally, I would like to thank you for your kind attention and if you, want, you have any question, don't hesitate to contact any of the members of this course.